Hey everybody and welcome to my week 17 updates. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to be doing two videos today for week 17 and week 18. Uh, I'm going to separate them so if I'm wearing the same clothes or I look the same, that's why. <laughs> okay, so week 17 I didn't have any time to update <clears throat> because I worked um, the whole week, seven days straight and... I told myself I was going to get up early to do it, or I'd do it that night when I got home, but I never did. <clears throat> I did manage to get my 17-week picture up last week, though, so that is on my baby blog, and I can link that again if anybody wants to go and see. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, so the biggest thing that happened this week, um, it happened just obviously randomly, but it was after dinner and we were just laying in bed and I think he was playing Xbox and I was like on the baby forum like usual and you, I felt the baby move for the very first time. So that was awesome. Um, it just, it didn't feel flutters like everybody said I would. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, it was more like the baby was like poking at me or punching or kicking or something. Um, he didn't feel it that time, but he felt it uh, and marked it on the calendar. I felt it on a Monday and he felt it that Saturday. So um, we kind of just have a joke because <laughs> he's the baby seems to be more active, especially right after I eat and take my prenatals and everything. And I have to take an iron pill, so we joke that when I take the iron pill because he moves a lot, we joke or she moves a lot, we joke that the baby is GTLing in there. If any of you know or watch Jersey Shore, then you know what I'm talking about. He's more, she's more gymming than anything. <clears throat> That's what we joke about. Because um, my fiance, he he works out a lot and. He's all like strong with muscles, so we think maybe the baby will come out like that too. <laughs> we know that won't really happen, but it's funny to to joke about. <clears throat> um, other things that have been going on, I noticed this week, and I know somebody asked me this question to answer it, um, wanting to know if I've been more gassy lately, <laughs> and um, yes, I noticed it. <clears throat> more so starting week 17 and all through week 17. Um, definitely been more gassy. I don't like it. I think it's gross. My fiance, like, well he's a guy. They don't care. Like if they fart, they fart. Nobody cares. But for girls, I think we're more, <clears throat> or at least I know that I'm more reserved than that. Like, I'll burp. Like, I don't care about burping, but farting, it is... <laughs> I don't know. It makes me all embarrassed. Uh, but he wants me to do that in front of him so bad, and I'm like, no, that's not ladylike. Like, I will never do that unless I'm, you know, sleeping and I can't help myself. I won't even know what's going on. <laughs> like, just don't tell me that I did it. <clears throat> But yes, so I've been gassy, and my throat has been like this too for the last few weeks. It's really annoying, I'm sorry. Um, other than that, I started eating oatmeal a lot again. Um, before getting pregnant, I, was, I don't know, I was kind of active, I think moderately. Um, I know M bought me a treadmill for Valentine's Day this year and I love it. <clears throat> so I started, you know, running on that a few times a week and I would run um, 5Ks maybe three or four times a week, which are just 3.1 miles. Um, but I stopped once I got pregnant. I think I got on there once and I always hurt my knee. I don't know what's going on even before I got pregnant. Um, but before getting pregnant, like, I was always a really healthy eater and just watching what I eat. Not because, like, well, yes, I'm terrified of gaining <laughs> bad weight. Um, 
but just because it makes me feel better if I eat a healthy meal rather than going and getting like McDonald's or something. You just have a different feeling after it. So I always watched what I ate and I even did the vegetarian thing for Lent, even though I'm not Catholic. <laughs> but um, yeah, so I went back to oatmeal, which I missed a lot. <clears throat> I've been um, eating it cold for breakfast that I take to work. Um, I guess they're called like overnight oats. And so I just make that with like milk and you just have it sit overnight. And I've been adding cinnamon and pumpkin spice to it. And then I'll cut up a banana and then put like a spoonful of almond butter in it. And it's really, really good and it's really filling. Um, so yes. And things that I haven't been liking. Still chicken. Um, I ate it the other night. Or was it last week? Um, but still I'm just not interested in chicken. I mean, like, I'll eat it. It doesn't make me feel sick or anything. It's just, it does not sound appetizing at all. <clears throat> um, I really just want to eat, like, a big plate of sushi. <laughs> I think I'll request that, like, right after I give birth. <laughs> a plate of sushi. Um, but no, that's pretty much it for 17. Um, the biggest thing was that the baby moved, and it was awesome. Um, I felt it, and then like four days later, M felt it. So it was, wasn't was consistent that week, but um, it has been this week, so it's been really cool. Uh, besides that, I think that's pretty much it. Oh, and I've been hungry all the time. Excuse me. I just ate. <clears throat> but I noticed my appetite um, has definitely gone up. Um, it wasn't like that in the beginning. <clears throat> I guess I wasn't really a big eater to start with. But now I'm like, I'm hungry. Um, and I gained a pound. I should be telling this for week 18, so I'll hold off for that. <laughs> um, but yeah, so baby's moving. I'm gassy. Eating more. I'm eating healthier, which is good, and that's it, I believe, for week 17. So I will upload this and start on week 18, so I'll see you in the next video. Bye!